It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas in Traverse City. I think you, you actually have to sing that when, when you say no that. No one wants to hear that. No. Not we, me, at least. We all want to hear that, don't <laughs> we? All right, so there's not much snow, so it's not really looking very seasonable. But many houses have already put their holiday decorations out in their yards. But there's one house that kind of stands out from the rest. 74's Mara Thompson joins us live from that very house. It's on Woodmere Avenue. All right, Mara, tell us all about it. Mark and Kristen, you can't pass this house without stopping to notice how beautiful all of these decorations are. But a lot of people are noticing the neighbor's house, and while it may not have as many decorations, it may just take the cake for being unique. So that's what I do, I, but, I, but I just love it. I love to decorate. Traverse City is filled with houses decked out for Christmas, but if you take a trip down Woodmere Avenue, you'll run into this. And it's beautiful, and it's just the fun of it, to get into the spirit of Christmas and what Christmas is all about to us. And, you know, it's, we can have the fun part of it, but then, you know, it's just... Just something different to do for it. Janine Jones has been decorating her house for decades, adding new things each year. But what do you do when you live next door and know the decorations you put up won't compete? There's no comparison. <laughs> I can't beat this, so I don't try anymore. So this is this is our solution right here. <laughs> that solution, this ditto sign put up by Janine and her roommate Mary, which grabs people's attention just as much. A lot of people are seeing it now. Yeah. My daughter called me this morning. It's like, it's viral. <laughs> Kathy Wiley says she loves being a part of the holiday spirit without all of the effort. <laughs> Number one, I don't want to do that. It's too much work. <laughs> so I'm just going to hop on their backs and take the ride for Christmas. That's what I do. <laughs> but Janine says having everyone notice the decorations is what makes it all worth it. And that's what it's all about to me. It's to, to give uh, to people out there. Um, you can be in a, have a bad day. And um, they go by the house and it puts a smile on their face and it, it makes me cry at times because it, it makes their day and th that's all it counts. These decorations are even more beautiful in person than they are on camera, so it's worth driving by. But if you can't make it this year, don't worry. Janine says she's not planning to stop decorating for Christmas anytime soon. Reporting live in Traverse City, Mara Thompson, 7 and 4 News. You just love everything about that story. Everything I, I from do. the effort that it took Janine right. to do, and then the yes. sense of humor that her neighbor has. Like, yeah, us too. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yes. You love how they play off each yeah. other, and uh, and and this time of year we need both. Exactly. Uh, we need people that go all out and people that make us laugh a little yeah. bit as well. Very nice. Love that. All right. A reminder for the.